a one-way ANOVA, or as also known as a single factor ANOVA, can be used to test if the means of more than two populations are all equal. It is assumed that the K populations are independent and normally dis distributed with means mu sub 1, mu sub 2, up to mu sub k and has a common variance of sigma squared. So our null hypothesis would be if we have five population means, uh, we assume that all the means are equal and therefore alternative uh, H1, at least two of the means are not equal. So you're given a table with k random samples and then n treatments. So the null hypothesis h sub o will be rejected at alpha when the f value is greater than the computed f value is greater than the critical value at number of degrees of freedom k minus 1 and k times n minus 1. So in this example, we have uh, k uh, five population means so k is equal to five and then we have n treatment so n is equal to six your k minus one is if k is five so that will be four and then your k times n minus one will be uh, five times 6 minus 1, so that will be 25. So at alpha 0 0.05, using the F table, so you have two number of degrees of freedom, 5 versus under 0 0.05, no? 5 versus, or rather 4 versus 25. So this is your V sub 1, and then your V sub 2 is 25. So the critical value is 2.76. But in this case, we'll be using the Excel function to analyze your data or to analyze our data. Okay, so go to data menu and then data analysis. Okay, and then look for okay, ANOVA single factor, then click OK here. And then select your data, your five versus data, and then input your alpha here. And then you can regroup by columns. So select, and then choose your output range. So let's say I put it here. and then select OK. And in this case, you have the... Sorry, these are the three important output. So based on this, the computed value is 4.3. So the, th this is the critical value, so therefore your F is greater than the critical value. So what is our conclusion? We will reject, okay, we will reject the null hypothesis so which means that at least at least two no? of the means are not equal the, the ANOVA will not tell you know which among these uh, means are not equal so it will only tell you that not all the means are 